Welcome to Flexcom 8, the preeminent industry-leading software for the design and analysis of risers and subsea structures for the world's most demanding offshore projects. This short presentation is divided up into four parts, introduction, model building, finite element analysis, and post-processing. For illustrative purposes, let's look at a sample flexible riser system analyzed in Flexcom. The model contains five flexible risers, which pass over a tethered midwater arch in a lazy S configuration. You're now looking at the model view. This is a graphical display, which allows the engineer to visually examine the structural response. A dedicated video creation studio also accompanies the main software, allowing you to create customized videos of finite element models. Video files are an effective means of showcasing innovative designs and serve as valuable promotional material for engineering teams. In this example, the flexible riser system is subjected to regular wave loading in a time domain dynamic simulation. The mid-water arch is modeled as a rigid frame structure which supports an arrangement of contact surfaces with uplift provided by buoyancy tanks. The mesh density in the contact region is relatively fine in order to accurately capture the interaction between the risers and the arch structure. Flexcom can graphically display element forces such as effective tension or bending moment, and this provides the engineer with an intuitive visual representation of the finite element results. Here we are focusing on the tethers and using the color contouring feature to visualize effective tension variations, as well as facilitating rotating, panning, and zooming, the model view provides other useful features, such as displaying node and element numbers, coordinate data, seabed topography, water surface profile, and many more. Now that we've looked at a completed model, let's now turn our attention to model building. Firstly, let's clean up the project directory, deleting any existing files. Model building is very straightforward with Flexcom. The program incorporates an automatic mesh creation facility that expedites the model creation process during the initial stages of a project. A structural preview facility is available while model creation is in progress. Data specification is aided by helpful input prompts and command auto-completion, while inaccurate specifications are detected by automatic syntax checking and data validation. The keyword editor is nicely color-coded for ease of use, while the automatic syntax checking and data validation combine to reduce the potential for error in input data specification. Flexcom offers a range of standard vessel profiles to provide enhanced visual appeal. You may choose to insert an FPSO, semi-sub, drill ship, spa, TLP, etc. into your model, or opt to define your own customized vessel. Specialized components such as BOPs and PLETs are also available. Vessel RAO data may be imported directly from programs such as Aqua, WAMIT, MOSES, and OrcaFlex. Flexcom understands the conventions used in these programs and automatically performs the relevant conversions. The imported RAO data may be visually inspected for reassurance. Flexcom is also equipped with context-sensitive help that provides instant access to useful information. Tabular-style inputs are quite popular with new software users until they become more familiar with the various keyword commands. As soon as you change an entry in the table editor, the alteration is immediately reflected in the keyword editor, and vice versa. Predefined input parameters form an integral part of a typical model specification. Numerical expressions may be used to combine different parameters, similar to standard spreadsheet software. Once a parameter is altered, all dependent parameters are automatically updated, with consequent savings for model setup effort. A list of all parameters, definitions, and computed values is available for inspection, with obvious benefits in terms of quality assurance. Now let's turn our attention to finite element analysis. Flexcom uses an industry-proven finite element formulation, incorporating a hybrid beam column element with fully coupled axial, bending, and torque forces. Flexcom's innovative solution technique is ideally suited to the modeling of slender offshore structures, 
which are characterized by significant geometric nonlinearities. To complement the time domain analysis, Flexcom also offers a highly efficient frequency domain solution. Typically used for screening analysis, it results in huge savings in terms of runtime. Analysis jobs may be initiated very easily, for example via the branch run feature. This automatically runs the selected file and all dependent files in the correct sequence. For convenience, analysis can be paused and resumed again at a later time. The software is also designed to simplify the quality assurance process. Designated icons provide an indication of the status of each analysis, informing the user of successfully completed runs and highlighting any that require further attention. If any alterations are made to the input data, a status icon alerts the user that the results could be obsolete and potentially misleading. These features reduce administrative overhead, allowing engineers to focus on more technical aspects and design challenges. A riser design scenario typically involves many regular waves of varying wave period and incident wave heading, so a large load case matrix can quickly accumulate. For example, regular wave periods typically range from 5 seconds up to 30 seconds, and various incident wave directions around the compass may be examined at, say, 30 degree intervals. Flexcom's innovative file generation facility means that a single parameterized master template file is capable of generating all the required input files. Metocean data which underpins structural fatigue assessment is typically presented as a scatter diagram. Such data may also be readily imported from a spreadsheet into Flexcom. Again, a single parameterized master template file is capable of generating all the required input files. Note also how a suitable file name may be automatically created to reflect the particular combination of HS and TZ contained within that file. Existing users of Flexcom may be interested to know that Flexcom 8 runs up to 40% faster than Flexcom 7. Now let's turn our attention to post-processing. Flexcom provides a range of post-processing options. Database post-processing is quite popular, where results are presented graphically. You may select from a list of variables, including effective tension, bending moment, and so on. If you're viewing a time history plot and a structural animation on screen simultaneously, a moving vertical line on the plot provides a direct link between the structural response and the associated engineering parameter. Flexcom is accompanied by a dedicated Excel add-in which allows you to extract results from Flexcom database files directly into Excel. For ease of use, some standard templates are provided on the Flexcom ribbon control. These are designed to instantly deliver standard solutions, but may be easily customized subsequently to meet particular requirements of individual users. There is also a helpful blank sheet template which serves as a universal starting point for generic data extraction. When you press any of the template buttons, a standard worksheet is inserted into your current workbook. Whereas database post-processing is very graphical and largely plot-based, summary post-processing by contrast is mainly text-based. A summary output file typically contains a succinct output of maximum, minimum, range and standard deviation of parameters of interest. Following the summary post-processing of several individual analyses in a load case matrix, a collation facility subsequently assembles all the output data into a central spreadsheet. This delivers tangible benefits for engineering teams, making it faster and easier to compile output data and extract pertinent results. If you would like further information on Flexcom, please send an email to software at mcskenny.com or visit our website. Thank you for watching.